Welcome back to NGT. We play Super Smash Bros. Melee. Featuring myself, Spencer, and my co-host, Matt. I'm playing as Falcon. Matt's playing as Falcon. We're live on Twitch.tv slash Gaming TV. Midway through, we'll be doing best of five with some slippy stats. Playing as America. Matt's, Matt's playing as the Green Ranger, who is his own person. Nice. We had a long neutral game for that one. I think if I was uh, better at uh, shield dropping, I would have been able to shield drop uh, knee you and beat out your knee. He caught me right before my shield came out. Another jump. Damn it. So we haven't had any Power Rangers this whole day. And you have one of the Power Rangers songs on Pokemon Stadium, don't you? No. I thought you did. Almost had it. Made it too far back, yeah. You cancel, baby. Damn.
I mean, I was already dead anyways, but at least it looked cool. not come out faster I was at zero percent I guess Damn. Maybe we should both go for fucking knees at the very beginning. I'm scared.
Damn. I didn't, like... I didn't not be able to do shit. <laughs> I just stand there. I'm not sure that would work. Nice. Yeah. I shouldn't have be right there. You really, uh, like, so my brain goes down like whole roads. It was like cities were the thoughts. Uh, and then, and then I get to a part that I think is funny. And sometimes I feel like I need to tell you how I got there. But you were throwing out a lot of nares. Mm -hmm. The beat up. Oh, shit. To beat out my uh, my other aerials, right? And I was like, oh man, those nares are really like it, it, the like well spaced nares were beating out like my back airs and, and and my and my forward airs and stuff like that, which is you know good, good thing to take note of. But then my brain was like thinking about if if uh, you were like Nun or SJJ, and then and then they were at Summit and they were talking to him about that, and then like Scar brings it up because it's something that he noticed, right? And then he's like, hey, you know, I noticed you were doing those nares and stuff like that. And then uh, the the player is like, yeah, I would take a well-spaced nair over any other aerial in that matchup any day. And that's just where my brain went. <laughs> just like morphing until I got to that point for that one like comment where I was like, eh. you know, that makes sense. Uh. All right. Best of five game one battlefield. That was just really bad. So I was just below. After a certain point, I was just like, this is where I'm at now.
Nice. Nice. That was like a race to the finish there. Game two on this nation. I was going to grab the ledge. All right, yeah. Okay, they're not for there. Oh. what I wanted at all. Damn it. One, one. The tough matchup, dude. Alright. Pokemon Stadium.
No. Cancel, baby. Oh, didn't, didn't V cancel that one. <laughs> Oh no, I fucked that up. It's hard. It's hard. Like I like I fucked it up for myself. Oh shit! <laughs> that was crazy. Uh, but I like I I, I I kept messing up my wave dashes. See that? I was just like popping up, and I, I was just like focused on that. Huh? And then before I knew it, I was off the stage. I'm like, wait, wait, no, 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 no. back up. <laughs> and I was like, ah, fuck, I'm gonna die here. Give <laughs> me the neither. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um. Where do Yoshi's? Game four. Yeah. Damn, I tried to land on Randall. I didn't know which one it was for a second. Yeah, me neither. Help me. Oh, I should have just held edge. But I was like, stomp him. Yeah, I, I didn't really know what I wanted to be doing there. I, I, I just spammed the B button by accident.
Nice. That was good. Didn't play as good as I did yesterday, but you know, what can you do? It was a long Falco day. Also, good. <laughs> it always feels weird when you end up playing the same character as I do, and you still like three, one me. I did three one you. I know. That's what I'm saying. It always feels weird when that happens. Like when you when you ditto and you beat me with my own character. I don't have to have too much pride in it. I just know that you have better fundamentals and stuff. Right. You know, I have like mental things I'm trying to work through, you know, like my chaos brain. Um, first game battlefield, three minutes and five seconds. I won. Uh, let's see here. I had 0.7 more damage per opening. That's really what got it. Like mm. when you really look at the data, that's, that's really what it was. Uh, actions. Well, recount, please. <laughs> uh, actions. Uh, I mean, and this is a really close game. I mean, just, just looking at the openings per kill and the damage per opening, that's crazy. You rolled 12 times. Arrows three times, but this once. I just hit you with the old turn one one. Sometimes that's all you need. You know? Harass their, uh, their, right, we got their workers. Okay, sorry. I was just... Neutral ones, you had eight. I had 15. You had seven counter I had four. Uh, you had three wave dashes, two wave lands, and 20 dash chances. I had 12, 2, and 32. Your inputs were 324. Mine were 395. You came with an up air, back air, forward air. I could do the forward air, an up tilt, a down air, and then a forward air. You had a 41% combo on my first stock. I had a 53% combo, uh, zero to death on your first stock, and then a 43% combo on your second stock. You had a 39% combo on my second stock. Then I had a 53% combo followed by a 42% combo on your third stock. A pretty good game for me. Final destination, three minutes and, and 16 seconds. Th uh, Austin 316. I only took two stocks. You rolled 10 times. And that, you know what? That's all you needed. Nothing else. I hit with the old 303. Uh, and your neutral ones were 20, mine were 14, and we had the exact same counter at 4 each. You wave dashed once, and wave landed once, and then I had 3, 4 dash chances, and I had had a 7, 2, and then 48. I think I remember wave landing back a couple of times. Inputs, you were at 301, I was at 408. That just shows you the difference uh, there between me, you, <laughs> uh, you killed me with two forward airs, a down air, and a forward air. In that case in point. And I killed you with two forward airs. Okay. You had a 35% combo on my first stock. I had a 46% combo on your first stock. You had a 39% combo on my second stock. Then a 36 on my third. And that was it. Last game, Pokemon Stadium. Two minutes and 44 seconds. Not last game. Sorry. Game three, Pokemon Stadium. Two minutes and 44 seconds. Went down to the last stock. You rolled five times, air dodge once. I rolled twice, air dodge seven times. And then spot dodged four times. Uh, new twins, you had 19, I had 6, you had 2 counters, I had 5, and you had the beneficial trade this time around. You hit me with the old wave dash once, wave land once, and then dash ants 11 times. Excuse me, 11, 11, make a wish. Uh, I had 4, 2, and 41. Your inputs were 319, mine were 381. You killed me with 2 forward airs, I self-destructed at 69%, and then you killed me with another forward air. It probably would have been another forward air kill. I mean, just look at the stats. The data really was going that direction. You, however, self-destructed twice, and then I killed you with an upbeat. You did not kill me with an upbeat. That's what down the data there says. And let you hit me with the upbeat so I could knee you. Well. And it worked. It it did work, and I did get the kill with the upbeat. Sometimes just the way it goes. I had a 44% combo on your first stock, and then uh, you had a 56% combo followed by a 37% combo on my last stock. That was it. Last game, Yoshi Story, 2 minutes and 33 seconds. I only took two stocks this time. You rolled t 10 times, and, you know, usually you just do the 10 rolls because that's like your standard, but you did throw in two air dodges this time around just to mix it up. I had two rolls and two air dodges. That's it. Your neutral ones were 14, mine were 10. Your counter were 8, mine were 4. Uh, you didn't wave dash at all, but you did wave line once, and then you dash danced four times. That's it. Yeah. You were literally up airing me the whole rest of the time and, and, uh, and r r rando... Uh, kneeing me and getting things off of it. You knew you could. I don't stay in shield enough and stay grounded and defend. I don't have any defensive play. <laughs> That's the big difference there. It's like, how is he getting away with this? I wouldn't be able to get away with this against him. And then I realized every time I try to do that, you're magically in shield. I'm not magically in shield. I'm in shield because I'm smart. I mean, no. It, you, it reveals to you know, like, oh, you're in shield now, right? But you're like, oh, he's going to uh, he, he's gonna try to aerial me. I mean, that's basically 90% of his gameplay. All right, shield. Sick. 
Did he space it? Oh, he did. That's miraculous. <laughs> um, I hit with a 7 one twenty six. You had 305 inputs per minute. So you were really just like chilling. And I was at 379. I say chilling, but that's like a normal speed for like our Marth. Or yeah, or like, like our Marth matchup. Um, you killed me with four forward airs. I killed you with two forward airs. You know what? There's only one move in the game, and it's called knee. On my first stock, you had a 41% combo. And that's it. The only combo in the whole game. Overall, fun games. I almost, like... I almost did really win. You know? Got close. A few times. Ultimately, uh, it comes down to the fact that... Uh, you were definitely better at just knowing what my holes are. I think in edge guarding. I go out there a lot to edge guard. Yeah, I th you have a lot more confidence in like what you're, what's possible. I've been trying to go out more often. Well, in, in, in the Falco matchup, I went out a bit more, but I'm, it, it's still like scary. There was a few times where I got knee kills where like I felt like I barely got them. Have you ever had that thing where your brain is telling you, oh, do the move, but but input a, a fade or, or or a fast fall or whatever, right? And you have to fight against yourself and be like, no, if I do any of those, I'll miss. That happened to me. Like, like in the middle of, of uh, like, hitting you onto the top platform, and I was on the side platform one of the games. I think it might have been Yoshi's. And I went to go jump to go knee you. I think I might have down aired you and then slid off and jumped to go knee you. And in the middle of that, I was like, all right, fade back a little bit. You're going to miss. And I'm like, wait, no, don't do anything. And my thumb was like, ah. And uh, luckily, I, I I just, I did the, the, the fast fall into the knee to like do the, you know, the kapah. You know how people do the, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the chic forward airs. I did it. And it hit. I was like, ah. Oh. But there was a moment where I was like, no, I need to fade back. And that happens to me all the time when I'm trying to do Marth up airs and stuff like that. When I'm trying to juggle. Um, it's just like it will line up but then I just don't believe it will and then I try to input some fading and direction stuff and it fucks it all up mm. or especially with uh, Samus uh, was it like up throw and then down air on the on the top platform I mess that shit up all the time too I can't just trust that I'm just gonna it's just gonna hit I feel like I need to put in some type of thing and then I mess it up yeah, you should really <sighs> delete that. Yeah, it's hard. The uncertainty. Mainly because I only ever get to those moments when we're like in an intense game. But I should just like not care as much. True. Really, I think what I should do is I should do the thing and be like, this is just a test. Beep, beep, and then beep, just like... Beep. Beep. Don't. This is a test. Regardless of what the situation is, just don't input anything, Weow. anything additional, and just do it. And then if that doesn't work, next time this is just a test. Move to the right a bit or some shit. See, that's my problem. I'm not creating data. I'm just overthinking situations and being like, I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, All right. Name anyways, for the episode. Name for the episode. Um, I had one about five minutes ago, I'm but sorry. I forgot. I, was, I, I rambled. My bad. Sometimes I just like talking about the games and stuff and chatting. Oh, look, I'm doing it again. Well, because I'm trying to give you time to think. I, I, I was hoping gone. that maybe you would just like, I would become white noise and you could just think of it. <laughs> um. Yeah, it's gone. It's gone. That sucks. I'm sorry. Because I'm just blurted out. In the episode is this. Uh, you're getting a lot of knees. Has something to do with knees? It did so have something to do with the knees. The only the only move in the game is knee. Yeah. There we go. Figured it out. All right. <laughs> All right. Uh, we're in calls to stream. Thanks so much for coming by. Thanks Edge for hanging chilling, out. Hanging out. Uh, thanks everyone else who might have come by and lurked and you know didn't say anything. It's cool. Um, we had someone else who came in. Um, Duck. Duck. Yeah. He said, "Yo, boys," and then we yeah. tried to have a conversation. And yeah. He was done. Uh, but cool. Uh, for those of you on YouTube, check us out live on Twitch.tv slash TV. We'll see everybody next time. Peace.